Hey everybody, um, I am here because um, I normally, and I have no idea where my other earring is, that is really weird. Um, I normally go live um, right about now on my Coach Roz page and um, I'm coming back from um, being with a sister of mine and she and I just had a really divine time together and as I was riding home driving home I'm still not home because I had stopped to make but um all this stuff started coming to my mind and I was instructed that I needed to go live on my personal page and not my business page for today's message and seriously I'm gonna oh, my earring I found it praise God so, um, what I wanted to share was, there are so many of us right now, um, who know we have divine assignments and we know that there are things that we're being led to do. We don't necessarily understand them. Um, and most of the time the people around us don't understand it either. Um, it's hard for us to explain it. And then... I was battling with the fact that I felt really, really alone and isolated. So, um, what has been brought to my attention is the fact that it's kind of like isolation is really a divine thing sometimes. It's kind of like if you ever watch like the family feud and you know when they're getting ready to pull the two players off and they're going to do um, the fast money round um, where one person will be right there with uh, with Steve Harvey and then the other person will go off, you know, stage somewhere and they put headphones on them and they're usually like listening to the music or something like that. So they're in their isolation booth and in the isolation booth, they can't hear anything that anybody is saying. All they can do is listen to music. So, since they're in that isolation booth, they can't hear what their partner is saying or what anybody else is saying. All they can do is concentrate on the fact that they know that they're up next and that they have to share something when they get to stand up there with Steve Harvey. So, a lot of us are in the isolation booth right now. We don't understand why we're in the isolation booth. It's lonely in the isolation booth. Meanwhile, everybody else is out in the audience and out in the world having a grand time. They're talking and they're doing all this. But what we don't see is the person that is not in the isolation booth is actually under more pressure. Why? Because they don't have time to collect their thoughts. They don't have time to get the answers downloaded divinely inside of them. They have to think right on their feet, off the cuff. They don't have time to gather themselves, to get clear-minded. They have to go, boom, right away. But us that's in isolation, during this divine time of isolation, what this is, is we're able to sit and have the music playing in our ears. We can have that connection to God, to spirit, and get the answers that we need. And we won't be influenced by anybody else's answers or anybody else's responses because we'll be receiving our own in our own um, divine download. So I just wanted to say the isolation booth is not a bad place to be. It's not. The isolation booth can be a blessing to you if you will accept it as a blessing. Because in the isolation booth, that is your opportunity to receive that time with the divine, to get that moment of clarity and divine instructions, to be able to just take a breath and take a step back. Everybody else, they might be flying by the seat of their pants right now, but you get that opportunity to just take a step back to gather your thoughts, to gather yourself, and to breathe.
yeah so that's what i wanted to just share that sometimes we're in isolation because we need to be we need to be it's a divine time and we have to use that time wisely because then when it's our turn to come out and show everybody else what we know what our gifts are and share it with the world we'll be ready because we had that time right okay so that's all i got don't know who that might have helped maybe it didn't help anybody and it just helped me i don't know but i just came to share that and i hope you have a wonderful wonderful evening bye for now